Bullies are absurd. Oh wait, bullies. Yeah, that's the worst name that I ever heard. Battling bullying by beatbox. If you want to steal lunch money, you don't think it's funny. And rap and rhyme. An innovative approach at this Brooklyn elementary school that led to victory in the borough's first ever anti-bullying video contest. It's opening new doors for people to stand up. And the rap is basically like telling people what is a bully. Something Daniel, a fifth grader, knows firsthand. I gotta admit, me myself, I used to be a bully. Like, I used to make fun of people and other things. Yeah, so starting like a new leaf. The unique program was English teacher Genevieve Beretta's idea. She says some of the words blew her away when she first heard them. Some people cry, some people want to die for real. That's a serious line. Some kids do want to die for real, I get a little weepy. So, it's a serious thing. If you're gonna push and serve somebody, all that, all that you're doing is just being mean to them and that hurts them and that can lead to bigger things. Like, they might, they might wanna like probably kill themselves because they have no reason living. Saying no to bullying is not just done through their rap performances. Here, it is practiced every day with a simple pledge. I pledge to praise people to give up put downs. Do you feel safe from bullies here at school and why? Yes, because this is a this is a no bullying school, and everyone doesn't bully. This is a peaceful school. Um, if anybody if anybody doesn't listen to the peace builders to the peace builders pledge, then that's their flaw. If you are a bully and you come to this school, you learn you learn how to not be a bully and be a better person and make the world a better place. Students here clearly feel safe from bullying. And in iVillage, we wanted to reach out to the parents. In a survey on iVillage.com, we're asking parents how confident they are their children's school protects them from bullies. What PS119 tries to do is protect kids by creating a culture of empathy, using rap to send a message to those who need to hear it most. Like, the rap can be so good that the bullies want to listen to it too. It entertains them and it also has the idea to make peace in the world. So if they see, see us rapping about bullying, then they'll realize that it's really wrong to do that. Don't be bad, don't be cool, just be rad and be cool. For iVillage, I'm Kelly Wallace.